This is living in Vegas is the greatest thing in the world. I mean, it's it's unbelievable. I'm from New York, so obviously I miss uh, New York a lot. But uh, I mean, the girls, the money, the everything is just it's unbelievable. Uh, I think this summer we spoke. I got uh, 275th in the main event and I uh, paid like just over 40,000 and I was 27 years old and single so I was like why not pretend like I never had this money I got a place in Vegas for the year a little bankroll and just uh, was out here for probably about I came for three weeks and stayed for like 16 months I came from nothing you know my family was poor when I grew up and food stamps and all that so uh, you know, the value of a dollar is, it means a lot to me. Like the first three years I came out here, I didn't even play the main. Like I was super, <clears throat> like everyone's like, why aren't you playing the main? And I'm playing like $400 deep stacks, you know? And like I just, uh, the way I was raised, was taught to, you know, value money and I still do. So like, I never really feel secure, you know? Like I always feel like, so like it all came so fast that it could all, you know, you feel like it could all go away. I need to go home at, at times and when I do it's, it's the best and then I'm home for like a month or two and I just need need to come back here you know I need the action and I miss the gambling I miss all that so you know you go to Atlantic City and like you said people are playing for their rent money when you come out here people come to Vegas with five thousand dollars to lose and when I live here I'm like well I have five thousand dollars to win I told my manager to stop sending me scripts I didn't want to look at them I wanted to take like a year off and then one year became two years two years became three and now it's uh, six years <laughs> have passed and they still call me every couple months and want to send me scripts and I just, uh, I love it too much, you know? Like everybody asks me if I'm a professional poker player and I feel like it's like the way people call themselves like an artist. Like what makes you an artist? Like I don't, I don't know. I think I'm better than a lot of poker players and there's some poker players I see that are just, you know, so next level and, and unbelievable and you learn so much from them. But as far as the job goes, I haven't had one in six years <clears throat> and uh, all I've been doing is is playing poker, but when people ask me, I always say no. You know, I never say I'm a professional poker player, but it's it's definitely all I do, and it's what what I would like to. I'd love to just play poker for for the rest of my life. You know.